Okay, I'm going to be unboxing the red 3DS XL. I, uh, my, I normally use my floor to unbox, and my floor is like wood, and with this and the floor, everything was like super red. So I just grabbed the cheap blanket and, uh, you know, put it there to stop the red glare. Oh boy. Anyways, uh, yeah, so I got this. Um, how I got it was, well, now I kind of don't have a PS Vita. I couldn't wait around for any games on that thing. I was getting a little impatient. Uh, yeah, but if, if it, uh, if they do anything with that later on, I'll get it again. I know I will. Um, however, if it does, in fact, do nothing, at least I, I got some money back for it and I was able to get this. Um, now, let's, where do we go? Oh, I, uh... It's a good thing I have a work table right next to me because I, you know, didn't bring a scissor over or anything. So, I got something. So, I'm sure there are plenty of uh, unboxings of this, but what the hell? Why not do another one? So, there's that. Alright. I want to do a half ass backwards unboxing, too. I'm going to do a crappy... Yeah, yeah, whatever I'm talking about. I'm not talking about anything. Ignore me. I'm stupid. Yeah. Okay. So... I'm going to pull out this stuff. Yay! Yeah, whatever. I don't care about any of this. You know what's in here. Come on. We know we the more important part is what's in here. And that is this. None of this crap matters. And here it is. The 3DS XL. It's the first time I'm actually looking at it in person. And I'll probably do a video letting you know what it's like. Wow. The uh this uh, circle pad actually feels... I, I, everybody was saying it, it was kind of the same. I, it feels a lot better than normal. So, yeah, that's kind of cool. Um, hmm. Yeah, so... Uh, not the volume. Yep. Cameras. Oh, Front-facing camera to... 3D back camera thingies and the stylus where it should be in the first place. I don't know why they moved it. Again, I had a bigger stylus that isn't, you know, something you can extend, but whatever. That's fine. I don't need, I always extend it anyway, so I don't know what the hell I'm talking about. Uh, triggers are okay. I don't know that they're any better or worse. Um,. They might be a little worse because it feels like the the back where the hinges are get kind of get in the way. Yeah, it, I think I like the old triggers better, but as far as the screen goes, looks good. And we got actual oh, there's that's nice. There's actual buttons. There's start, home, and select, and all that. It's not that weird thing they had before. D-pad, buttons are basically, you know, X, Y, B, A, buttons are the same, basically. Power power button, it's a little too flush <clears throat> with the system, but, you know, I think that's okay. That'll be fine. Uh, it's got two speakers over here, here, and I really can't wait to give this thing a shot because, yeah, um, I wish it did have the... the dual analog sticks there's definitely a spot where you could put one but it doesn't and uh what else um yeah so your little cart port over here let me fold this thing up you get your cart port <laughs> and the power which looks like the same power so yeah it's the same power adapter i guess and i don't know i think that's it really um, there's the SD card port. Let me see if it comes, I think it comes with an SD card, right? It better, I'll rip someone's head off. No. 
Yeah, it comes with a 4 gig. The last one came with, an, with a 1 gig. Well, that's nice. A Lexar 4 gig. So that's cool. Nice addition. Uh, I was happy with the 1 gig. So that's cool. I guess they got more stuff on there now, so more space plus plus the uh, retail games being on there it's it's actually makes more sense and even though I do really actually like the way the that um, glossy red looks better than this it I gotta be honest you know that that is a finger fingerprint magnet and yeah but I uh, definitely got to give this a shot and I'm gonna let you guys know what I think, as opposed to what everybody else that's made a video thinks. <laughs>